meeting people we have finished learning about the countries their flags and the famous monuments all around the world now we will learn about the famous personalities around the world walter elias disney an american film cartoonist is famous for animated cartoons we all know him as walt disney and love the characters created by him like mickey mouse and donald duck walt disney created the first sound cartoon the first all color cartoon and the first animated feature length motion picture one of the dreams of this great dreamer was to open a large amusement park in 1955 disneyland opened in california Walt Disney's Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs was the first full-length cartoon film. Jawaharlal Nehru Jawaharlal Nehru was a major political leader of the Indian National Congress and the first and longest serving prime minister of independent India. He is also referred to as Pandit Nehru. We celebrate his birthday as Children's Day in India. Mother Teresa Mother Teresa was born on August 26, 1910 in Skopje, now the capital of the Republic of Macedonia. She founded the Missionaries of Charity in Kolkata, India in 1950. For over 45 years, she ministered to the poor, sick, orphaned and dying while guiding the Missionaries of Charity's expansion. first throughout india and then in other countries we call her mother she took care of the poor and needy mahatma gandhi mohandas karamchand gandhi was born in borbandar a coastal town in present day gujarat western india on 2nd october 1869 his father karamchand gandhi and mother putli bai He was a major political and spiritual leader of India and the Indian independence movement. He was the pioneer of Satyagraha, firmly founded upon Ahimsa or total non-violence which led India to independence and inspired movements for civil rights and freedom across the world. He is commonly known around the world as Mahatma Gandhi. He is officially honored in India as the father of the nation. His birthday 2nd October is celebrated as Gandhi Jayanti and worldwide as the International Day of Nonviolence. He chose to wear a dhoti because many people of his country were poor and could not afford to buy proper clothes. Enid Blyton. Enid Mary Blyton was a British children's writer known as both Enid Blyton and Mary Pollock. She was one of the most successful children's storytellers of the 20th century. Once described as a one-woman fiction machine, she is noted for numerous series of books based on recurring characters and designed for different age groups. Her books have enjoyed popular success in many parts of the world and have sold over 400 million copies. She is behind Lenin and almost equal to Shakespeare one of her most widely known characters is naughty intended for beginning readers apj abdul kalam bharat ratna dr avul pakir jainul abdin abdul kalam born in october 15 1931 tamil nadu india usually referred to as dr apj abdul kalam was the 11th president of india serving from 2002 to 2007 due to his unconventional working style he is also popularly known as the people's president he was awarded india's highest civilian honor bharat ratna in 1997 for his work with drdo and his role as a scientific advisor to the indian government He is popularly known as the missile man of India for his work on development of ballistic missile and space rocket technology.
Jackie Chan Jackie Chan, born on 7th April 1954, is an actor, action choreographer, film director, producer, martial artist, comedian, screenwriter, entrepreneur, singer and stunt performer from Hong Kong. Jackie Chan is one of the best known names worldwide in the areas of kung fu and action films. In his films, he is known for his acrobatic fighting style, comic timing, use of improvised weapons, and innovative stunts. Sonu Nigam Sonu Nigam, born July 30, 1973, in Faridabad, Haryana, India, is a highly acclaimed Indian playback singer whose songs have been featured in numerous Bollywood and Kannada movies. He has also released numerous Hindi pop albums and acted in a few Hindi future films. Sonu Nigam began his singing career at the age of three. He moved to Mumbai with his father to begin his Bollywood singing career at the age of 18. Michael Jackson Michael Joseph Jackson is an American recording artist, entertainer and businessman. Referred to as the King of Pop, five of his solo studio albums of The Wall, Thriller, Bad, Dangerous and History have become some of the world's best-selling records. Amitabh Bachchan Amitabh Bachchan, born on October 11, 1942, is an Indian film actor. He first gained popularity in the early 70s and has since become one of the most prominent figures in the history of Indian cinema. Bachchan has won numerous major awards in his career, including three National Film Awards and 12 Filmfare Awards. He holds the record for most number of Best Actor nominations at the Filmfare Awards. In addition to acting, Bachchan has worked as a playback singer, film producer, and television presenter and was an elected member of the Indian Parliament from 1984 to 1987. Bill Clinton William Jefferson Bill Clinton, born on August 19, 1946, served as the 42nd President of the United States from 1993 to 2001. He was the 15th Democrat elected to that office. He was the third youngest president, only older than Theodore Roosevelt and John F. Kennedy when he went into office. He became president at the end of the Cold War and as he was born in the period after World War II, he is known as the first baby boomer president. Come on kids, let us know about some of the most celebrated persons. Keshav Shankar Pillai was popularly known as Shankar. Shankar has been India's most celebrated cartoonist. He founded the Children's Book Trust in 1957. A.T. Aryaratne is popularly known as the Gandhi of Sri Lanka. A.T. Aryaratne is the founder and president of Sarvodhya Shramadhana movement in Sri Lanka. The Lady Pesichette It is said that Lady Pesichette may be the first recorded female doctor. She was possibly the mother of Akitotep. She is referred to as Lady Overseer of the Lady Physicians. Kids, now let's learn about some famous personalities of India. Rabindranath Tagore Tagore is referred to as Gurudev as a mark of respect. He wrote Janagana Mana, our national anthem. Rajiv Gandhi Rajiv Gandhi was born in 1944 and served as the Prime Minister of India from 1984 to 1989. Sushmita Sen Sushmita Sen was born on November 19, 1975 in Hyderabad, India. In 1994, at the age of 18, Sushmita won the title of Femina Miss. 
Sen represented India at the Miss Universe pageant and Sushmita won the Miss Universe 1994 contest. Subhash Chandra Bose Subhash Chandra Bose was popularly known as Netaji. Bose was a leader in the Indian independence movement. He was born on January 23, 1897 in Katak, Orissa to a successful lawyer Janakinath Bose and Prabhavati. Netaji formed the Indian National Army and inspired his army with the battle cry Delhi Chalo. Here we can learn about some famous people from around the world. Benazir Bhutto was a Pakistani politician who chaired the Pakistan People's Party, a center-left political party in Pakistan. Bhutto was the first woman elected to a lead Muslim state. Neil Armstrong Neil Alden Armstrong was born on August 5, 1930 in Wapakoneta, Ohio. He has two college degrees. Armstrong was a Navy pilot from 1949 to 1952. After leaving the Navy, he worked as a test pilot. Neil Armstrong was a test pilot when he was chosen to be an astronaut. His first space flight was aboard Gemini 8 in 1966. Margaret Thatcher Thatcher is a British stateswoman born in 1925. She is the first woman to serve as prime minister. Margaret Thatcher served as British prime minister from 1979 to 1990 and leader of the Conservative Party from 1975 until 1990 being the first woman to hold either post. Sir Charles Spencer Chaplin Jr, better known as Charlie Chaplin, was an English comedy actor. Chaplin became one of the most famous actor as well as a notable director and musician in the early to mid Hollywood cinema era. He is considered to be one of the finest mimes and clowns ever caught on film and has greatly influenced performers in this field. He acted in, directed, scripted, produced and eventually scored his own films. Chaplin was also one of the most creative and influential personalities in the silent film era. George W. Bush. He is the 43rd president of the United States, son of George Herbert Walker Bush. George Walker Bush originally inaugurated on January 20th, 2001. Bush was first elected in the 2000 presidential election and re-elected for a second term in the 2004 presidential election. Louis Braille. Louis Braille is a French educationist. He as a teacher of the blind devised the touch system of reading and writing. Bachindri Bai. Bachindri Bai was the first Indian woman and the fifth woman in the world to scale Mount Everest. Dayanand Saraswati. Dayanand Saraswati was a social reformer, founder of Arya Samaj. He fought for the removal of social evils in India. Nelson Mandela. Nelson Mandela was the first black president of South Africa. He was imprisoned for about 27 years for fighting for equality among human beings. Rakesh Sharma becomes the first citizen of India to go into space when he flew aboard Soyuz T11 in 1984. Squadron leader Rakesh Sharma was a test pilot who later became a cosmonaut. When Rakesh Sharma landed on space, Prime Minister Indira Gandhi on a live television broadcast asked him in Hindi, "How India looked from outer space?" He replied, "Sare jahan se acha." Dr. Rajendra Prasad. Dr. Rajendra Prasad was the first president of the Republic of India. He was an independence activist and as a leader of the Congress party, 
Rajendra Prasad was drawn into the Indian freedom struggle soon after starting his career as a lawyer. Played a prominent role in the Indian independence movement, Prasad was born in Bihar, his father Mahadev Sahai, his mother Kamleshwari Devi. Dr. Sarvepalli Radhakrishnan Sir Sarvepalli Radhakrishnan was an Indian philosopher and statesman. He was the first Vice President of India and the second President of India. His birthday is celebrated in India as Teacher's Day. Sarvepalli Radhakrishnan was born at Tirthani, a town in Tamil Nadu. Dr. Zakir Hussain Dr. Zakir Hussain was the third President of India from May 13, 1967 until his death on May 3, 1969. He was awarded the highest Indian national honor, the Bharat Ratna, in 1963. Hussain was born in Hyderabad. After serving as the governor of Bihar from 1957 to 1962, and as the Vice President of India from 1962 to 1967. Hussein was elected President of India on May 13, 1967. V. V. Giri Varaha Giri Venkatagiri, commonly known as V. V. Giri, was the fourth president of the Republic of India from 24th August 1969 to 23rd August 1974, 10th August 1894 to 23rd June 1980. He became Minister of Labour. After India gained independence, he was first appointed High Commissioner to Ceylon and then successfully ran for Parliament in 1952. Serving as Minister of Labour until resigning in 1954. He served successfully as Governor of Uttar Pradesh, Kerala and Mysore. Muhammad Hidayatullah Muhammad Hidayatullah was the first Muslim Chief Justice of India. He served as the Acting President of India on two occasions and was also the Vice President of India for one complete term. Practiced as advocate at the Nagpur High Court from 1930 to 1946, served as judge of Nagpur High Court from 1946 to 1954. Fakhruddin Ali Ahmed Fakhruddin Ali Ahmed was President of India from 1974 to 1977. Ahmed was born on May 13, 1905, in Delhi to Colonel Zalnur Ali Ahmed and Rakia Sultan. He was awarded an honorary doctorate by the University of Pristina, Kosovo in 1975 during his visit to Yugoslavia. B. D. Jati Basappa Danappa Jati was born at Karnataka State. He was President of India from February 11, 1977 to July 25, 1977. After the 1952 general elections, he was appointed Minister of Health and Labour. Jati became member of the Mysore Legislative Assembly after the reorganization and was Chairman of the Land Reforms Committee. He became Chief Minister in 1958 and continued in that office until 1962. Neelam Sanjeeva Reddy Neelam Sanjeeva was an Indian statesman. He was the sixth President of India, serving from 1977 to 1982, and was the only person to be elected President of India unopposed. He was born in Andhra Pradesh. In 1952, he was elected as a member of the Rajya Sabha. Gyani Zail Singh Gyani Zail Singh served as the 7th President of India between 1982 and 1987. Zail Singh's public life was long and varied. Freedom fighter, state congress leader, 
Chief Minister, Minister and the President of India. Gyani Jail Singh died in a road accident on December 25, 1994. R. Venkatraman Sri Ramaswamy Venkatraman was the 8th President of the Republic of India, serving from 1987 to 1992. Before his election as President, he served nearly 4 years as the 7th Vice President. Venkatraman was born in Patukote near Tanjavur in Tamil Nadu. He was the member of Constituent Assembly that draft India's constitution. Dr. Shankar Dayal Sharma Shankar Dayal Sharma was the ninth president of Republic of India, serving from 1992 to 1997. Dr. Sharma had been the 8th Vice President of India under President Ramaswamy Venkatraman. During 1940s, he was involved in the struggle for Indian independence from the British and joined the Indian National Congress, a party which he would remain loyal to for the rest of his life. In 1952, he became the Chief Minister of Bhopal and served in that position until the state reorganization of 1956. K. R. Narayanan Kocheril Raman Narayanan, also known as K. R. Narayanan, was the 10th President of the Republic of India. K. R. Narayanan died on 9th November 2005 at the Army Research and Referral Hospital, New Delhi. Dr. A. P. J. Abdul Kalam Bharat Ratna Dr. Awul Pakir Jainulabdeen Abdul Kalam, born October 15, 1931, Tamil Nadu, India, usually referred to as Dr. A. P. J. Abdul Kalam, was the 11th President of India, serving from 2002 to 2007. As the Project Director, he was heavily involved in the development of India's first indigenous satellite launch vehicle, SLV-3. He has received honorary doctorates from as many as 30 universities. The government of India has honored him with the nation's highest civilian honors, the Padma Bhushan in 1981, Padma Vibhushan in 1990 and the Bharat Ratna in 1997. Srimati Pratibha Devi Singh Patel Pratibha Devi Singh Patel is the current President of India, the 12th person and first woman to hold the office. Patel represented Edlabad constituency in Jalgaon district, Maharashtra, as a member of the Maharashtra Legislative Assembly and was Deputy Chairwoman of the Rajya Sabha, Member of Parliament from Amaravati in the Lok Sabha, and the 24th and the first woman governor of Rajasthan. Jawaharlal Nehru Jawaharlal Nehru was the first and the longest serving Prime Minister of independent India. As one of the founders of the non-aligned movement, he is also referred to as Pandit Nehru. Nehru was born in the city of Allahabad. Nehru's birthday is celebrated as Children's Day and children call him as Nehru uncle. Mr. Nehru had led the Congress to a major victory in the 1957 elections, but his government was facing rising problems and criticism. Nehru played a major role in shaping modern India's government and political culture along with sound foreign policy. He is praised for creating a system providing universal primary education. He died in the early hours of 27th May 1964. Gulzari Lal Nanda Gulzari Lal Nanda was the interim Prime Minister of India twice for 13 days each. The Government of India honoured Nanda with the Bharat Ratna Award in 1997. Nanda was born on 4th July 1898 in Punjab province of British India. He was imprisoned for Satyagraha in 1932 and again from 1942 to 1944. 
Nanda is the only Prime Minister of India who did not have a house of his own. Lal Bahadur Shastri Lal Bahadur Shastri was the third Prime Minister of the Republic of India. Lal Bahadur was born in the year 1904 in Mughal Sarai. His father Sharda Prasad was a poor school teacher who later became a clerk in the revenue office at Allahabad. Lal Bahadur's father died when he was only a year and a half old. In 2005, the government of India opened the Lal Bahadur Shastri Memorial and set up a library in New Delhi. Indira Gandhi Indira Priyadarshini Gandhi was the Prime Minister of the Republic of India for three consecutive terms. In 1999, she was voted the greatest woman of the past thousand years in a poll carried by BBC News, ahead of other notable women such as Queen Elizabeth I of England, Mary Curie and Mother Teresa. Born in the politically influential Nehru dynasty, she grew up in an intensely political atmosphere. She was India's first and to date only female Prime Minister. Indira Nehru Gandhi was born on 19th November 1917 to Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru and his wife Kamala Nehru. Indira Nehru Gandhi was assassinated by his own guards. She was cremated on 3rd November near Rajgat and the place was called Shakti Sthal. Morarji Desai Morarji Rachorji Desai was the Indian independence activist and the Prime Minister of India from 1977 to 1979. He is the only Indian to receive the highest civilian awards from both India and Pakistan, the Bharat Ratna and Nishane Pakistan. Morarji Desai was born in Bombay Presidency. He spent many years in jail during the freedom struggle and owing to his sharp leadership skills and tough spirit. Before the independence of India, he became Bombay's Home Minister and later was elected as Chief Minister of Bombay State in 1952. In retirement, he lived in Bombay and died at the age of 99. He had been honoured much in his last years a freedom fighter of his generation. Charan Singh Chaudhary Charan Singh was the 7th Prime Minister of the Republic of India, serving from 28th July 1979 until 14th July 1980. Charan Singh entered politics as part of the independence movement. Charan Singh was born on 23rd December 1902 in Uttar Pradesh. In 1952, he became the Revenue Minister of State of Uttar Pradesh the most popular state in independent India. Charan Singh passed away on 29th May 1987. Rajiv Gandhi Rajiv Gandhi, the elder son of Indira and Feroz Gandhi, was the ninth Prime Minister of India. He was the youngest Prime Minister of India. His grandfather was the Indian independence leader Jawaharlal Nehru. Rajiv was born in 1944, during a time when both his parents were in and out of British prisons. Rajiv Gandhi's last public meeting was at Sri Parambadur on 21st May 1991, in a village approximately 30 miles from Madras, Tamil Nadu, where he was assassinated while campaigning for the Sri Parambadur Lok Sabha Congress candidate. V.P. Singh Vishwanath Pratap Singh was the 10th Prime Minister of the Republic of India. V.P. Singh entered local politics in Allahabad during the Nehru era. He was appointed by Indira Gandhi as the Chief Minister of Uttar Pradesh in 1980. V.P. Singh died on 27th November 2008. Chandrasekhar Chandrasekhar Singh was the 11th Prime Minister of the Republic of India. He was born on April 17, 1927 to a farming family in eastern Uttar Pradesh. From 1962 to 1967, 
Shekhar belonged to the Rajya Sabha, the upper house of the Parliament of India. He was called a young Turk. Shekhar died at the age of 80 in New Delhi on July 8, 2007. P. V. Narsimha Rao Pamula Parthi Venkata Narsimha Rao, who was commonly known as P. V. Narsimha Rao, served as the 12th Prime Minister of the Republic of India. Narsimha Rao was an active freedom fighter during the Indian independence movement and joined full-time politics after independence as a member of the Indian National Congress. Rao suffered a heart attack on 19 December 2004 and was taken to the All India Institute of Medical Sciences where he died 14 days later at the age of 83. Atal Bihari Vajpayee Atal Bihari Vajpayee, born December 25, 1924, served as the 13th and 16th Prime Minister of India. Vajpayee's involvement in politics began as the freedom fighter, only to abandon in its short span. He had been projected to be participated in the Quit India movement. H.D. Devagauda Haradana Hali Dodde Gauda Deva Gauda was the 12th Prime Minister of the Republic of India and the 14th Chief Minister of the State of Karnataka. Deva Gauda was born in 1933 in Karnataka. He plunged into politics at the early age when he joined the Congress Party in 1953 and remained a member till 1962. I.K. Gujral Indar Kumar Gujral served as the 15th Prime Minister of the Republic of India. Born in the town of Jhelum in western Punjab, now in Pakistan, he actively took part in India's freedom struggle and was jailed in 1942 during the Quit India movement. In the tumultuous days of June 1975, he was Minister of Information and Broadcasting. Dr. Manmohan Singh Manmohan Singh was born on 26 September 1932 in Ga, Punjab. He is the 17th and current Prime Minister of the Republic of India. He was the Governor of the Reserve Bank of India from 1982 to 1985. Manmohan during the 1970s, he worked for the Ministry of Foreign Trade and the Finance Ministry of India. Some important persons Vasco da Gama Vasco da Gama, the famous Portuguese navigator, discovered the sea route from Western Europe to the East by way of the Cape of Good Hope. He was sent by King John III as the Portuguese Viceroy to India. Madam Mira Richard Madam Mira Richard, popularly known as Mother, was a French woman who became Sir Arbindo's disciple. She helped in founding the Arbindo Ashram and the town of Arawile in Pondicherry. Madam Bekaji Ristam Kama Madam Bekaji Ristam Kama holds the credit of designing the national flag. She displayed the national flag at the Socialist Congress at Sattgart, Germany on August 22, 1907. Akbar was a lover of arts and intellectual people. He had nine genius men or Navratans in his court who held most honorable positions. Faizi was a poet who wrote in Persian. Akbar had enormous respect for his genius and appointed him as his son's tutor. Birbal a poor Brahmin was appointed to the court of Akbar for his wit and wisdom. Birbal was a poet too and his writings under the pen name Brahma was preserved in Bharatpur Museum. Freedom Fighters Lala Lajpat Rai was an Indian author and politician who is chiefly remembered as a leader in the Indian fight for freedom from the British Raj. Rai was born on January 28, 1865. 
in village Dudike in present day Moga districts of Punjab, India. Bhagat Singh was born on September 27th, 1907. March 23rd, 1931 was an Indian freedom fighter. Born to a family which had earlier been involved in revolutionary activities against the British Raj in India, Singh as a teenager had studied European revolutionary movements. Vinayak Damodar Savarkar, born May 28, 1883 in Bhagur. February 26, 1966 in Mumbai was an Indian politician and an Indian independence movement activist, commonly addressed as Veer Savarkar. Usha Mehta was born on 25th March 1920. 11th August 2000 was a renowned Gandhian and freedom fighter of India. She is also remembered for operationalizing the Congress Radio, also called the Secret Congress Radio, an underground radio station which functioned for few months during the Quit India Movement of 1942. Vallabhai Patel was a political and social leader of India who played a major role in the country's struggle for independence and guided its integration into a united independent nation. Bikaiji Rustam Kama was a prominent figure in the Indian independence movement. Bikaiji Rustam Kama was born on 24th September 1861 in Bombay into a large well-off Parsi family. Kids, now let us learn about some famous personalities. Alexander the Great was an ancient Greek king of Macedon. He was one of the most successful military commanders of all time and is presumed undefeated in battle. Dada Bai Naoroji was an intellectual, educator, cotton trader and an early Indian political leader. His book Poverty and un-British rule in India brought into the limelight the drain of India's wealth into Britain. Florence Nightingale Who came to be known as the Lady with the Lamp was a pioneering nurse, writer and noted statistician. Florence Nightingale was born into a rich, upper-class, well-connected British family at the Villa Columbia. Christopher DeLaulier Reeve was an American actor, director, producer and writer. Reeve was born in New York City on September 25th, 1952. He established himself early as a Juilliard trained stage actor before portraying Superman in four films from 1978 to 1987. Reeve died at age 52 on October 10, 2004. Sir Ben Kingsley is an English actor. He is one of the few men to have won all four major motion picture acting awards, receiving Oscar, BAFTA, Golden Globe, and Screen Actors Guild Awards throughout his career. Dr. Pranay L. Roy is an Indian media figure. He is founder and the president of New Delhi Television, NDTV. He rose to fame with the program The World This Week and the election coverage on Dildarshan. Sabir Bhatia is the co-founder of Hotmail, 
Sabir Bhatia was born to a Punjabi family in Chandigarh, India. Hotmail was sold to Microsoft for a reported sum of $400 million. Napoleon Bonaparte, later known as Emperor Napoleon I, was a military and political leader of France whose actions shaped European politics in the early 19th century. Queen Elizabeth I was Queen of England and Queen of Ireland from 17th November 1958 until her death. Elizabeth was born in Greenwich Palace in the Chamber of Virgins on 7th September 1533. Abraham Lincoln was the 16th President of the United States. Lincoln became the first American President to be assassinated. Saddam Hussein was the President of Iraq from 16th July 1979 until 9th April 2003. Saddam played a key role in the 1968 coup that brought the party to long-term power. Captured by US forces on 13 December 2003, Saddam was brought to trial under the Iraqi interim government set up by US-led forces and was sentenced to death by hanging. Hammurabi, sixth ruler of Babylon, lived about 3,500 years ago. He is the world's first law-making king who set up laws to govern his citizens. Tutankhamun, Paroa of Egypt, was only 18 when he died in 1351 BC. His tomb in the Valley of the Kings contain the most amazing treasures. Socrates, Plato and Aristotle were the greatest Greek philosophers. Their ideas have influenced people over the last 2400 years. Aristotle, a student at the academy, he later started a school, the Lyceum in Athens. Kids, now let us learn some of the famous sports personalities of different countries. Sanya Mirza Sanya Mirza is an Indian tennis player. Mirza began playing tennis at the age of 6, turning professional in 2003. Sanya picked her maiden Grand Slam title in the 2009 Australian Open. Major Dhyanchan Singh Major Dhyanchan Singh was a former Indian hockey player. He was part of the gold-winning Indian team in three Olympic Games. He was awarded the Padma Bhushan, India's third highest civilian honor in 1956. Ricky Thomas Ponting Ricky Thomas Ponting is a professional cricketer who is the current captain of the Australian cricket team in One Day International, 2020 International and Test Cricket. Ponting reached international standards at the age of for a batsman, making his One Day International and Test debuts in 1995 at the age of 20. Eldrick Ton Tiger Woods is an American professional golfer whose achievements to date rank him among the most successful golfers of all time. Currently the world number one, he was the highest paid professional athlete in 2007. Ronaldo Ronaldo is a Brazilian professional footballer who currently plays for Campeonato Brasileiro Club. Ronaldo was born in Bento Ribeiro. Shiny Abraham Shiny Abraham is an Indian athlete. 
She has been a national champion in 800 meters for 14 years. Born at Thodupula village in Iduki district of Kerala. Dibyundu Barua Dibyundu Barua is a chess grandmaster hailing from the city of Kolkata in the Indian state of West Bengal. He is the second Indian to become a grandmaster after Vishwanadhananan. Lance Armstrong Lance Armstrong is an American professional road racing cyclist who rides for UCI, Union Cyclist International. Vijay Amritraj Vijay Amritraj is a former Indian tennis player, sports commentator and actor. He was awarded the Padma Shri in 1983. Amritraj was the captain of the Indian Davis Cup for much of the late 1970s and 1980s. Vishwanathan Anand Vishwanathan Anand is an Indian chess grandmaster and the current world chess champion. Anand was born on 11th December 1969 in Chennai, Tamil Nadu. David Beckham David Beckham is a British football player with a huge fan following. David Robert Joseph Beckham He is an English football midfielder. Beckham was born at Whips Cross University Hospital in Leytonstone, England. Stephanie Maria Graf Stephanie Maria Graf is a German tennis legend. The third woman in tennis history to win all four major world tournaments. The Australian Open, French Open, Wimbledon and US Open in 1988 in a single calendar year. Michael Jeffrey Jordan Michael Jeffrey Jordan is an US basketball player. He played for the Chicago Bulls. Michael Jordan is a retired American professional basketball player and active businessman. Courtney Andrew Walsh Courtney Andrew Walsh is a former international cricketer who represented the West Indies from 1984 to 2001. He broke Kapil Dev's record of 434 wickets in test cricket. He was the first man to take 500 wickets.